Okay, guys, um, so today I'm going to make a video about onion skinning because, um, there's not a lot of videos out there about onion skinning, and I think onion skinning, in my opinion, is a very, 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 very important tool. So what we're going to be doing today is we're going to be, um, using open tunes, and I'm going to teach you guys how to turn on onion skinning, like you can in Blender. Um, so... We're going to name this scene test. That's what I always name mine. A uh, create scene. Yes. Um. Now what we're going to do here is we're going to draw a little ball or a little square or you know what? Screw this. We're going to draw a little ball and we're going to go in and it completely disappears how is that possible so as you can see and you if you hover over this it says double click to toggle onion skinning double click nothing happens so go on to this next part and click it hey it reappears okay guys um there is um and then if you click on that you can sort of like Bring that on, and then you can go on, like, the before-after frames and stuff. So then you can, like, see the before and after frames. So, um, for example, now, if, for example, I draw, like, another ball a little bit more down, and then I come down to the next frame, uh, it'll show both. And then if I go, and then if I, um, draw another ball down here... And then I go back up to this, it'll show all three before and after frames. Um, that'll be, that'll be all for this video, guys. Thank you for watching this little, quick little onion skinning tutorial. Um, if you haven't already, subscribe if you feel like I've earned your subscription. And like the video if you really do like it. Thanks for watching. For now, goodbye.